Uh, well, no one will argue you should wash your hands after you use the restroom, but how you dry them is up for debate. Is that hand dryer in the bathroom really blowing germs all over the place? Amy Davis is here. Uh, you put them to the test, Amy, to find out. We did. So you've probably heard or read the reports from researchers at respected universities like Harvard and major medical schools all over the world. They say hot air hand dryers can blow bacteria like fecal matter all over your hands. But we had to test it ourselves to answer the question to air dry or towel dry. We wanted to know which is safer. Soap up, wash, and then what? I like the hand dryers because then you don't have to touch anything. I feel like I'm killing less trees. I prefer paper towels. Jack Matt tests air quality with IAQ Environmental. We asked him to test the air coming out of the bathroom hand dryers at a gas station in southwest Houston and a wholesale warehouse in West Houston. In each bathroom, he held a petri dish directly under the airflow of the dryers. This is the agar for the food for the bacteria. Any bacteria that may have blown out onto your hands was captured in these dishes and sent to a lab to culture. After two weeks, this is what our Petri dishes looked like. I knew we were going to find some bacteria. It's healthy bacteria that's normally in the air. While the gas station Petri dish looks like it has more bacteria, lab results show none of these are concerning. But this found in the warehouse chain restroom? It can be a problem. Very serious. And the problem, Bacillus cereus, a bacteria related to food poisoning that causes diarrhea, nausea, and flu-like symptoms. Say you wash your hands before ordering lunch. But if it's on your hands, there's a good chance that you can, you know, put it in your system. It's why if there are paper towels, Matt says using one to dry your hands should be your first choice. If I, I can't find a, a paper towel, then I'll just, you know, shake my hands off. All right, so Matt says that the bacteria that comes out of the hand dryer is being pulled from inside the restroom. So if you're in a bathroom that's dirtier with more germs and bacteria, it's reasonable to expect that bacteria is sucked into the dryer intake and pushed out onto your hands. It's why he was surprised that he didn't see E. coli or fecal matter from those lab tests. Uh -huh. Good news, but I mean, because okay. other studies have shown that you can find that. Yes, it's good to know. So yes. if there's a towel there, use it. They Otherwise, say that, a, an air dry is suffice. Like this. Like this. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Got it. Thank you for that. Yeah. Uh, that's news you can use right there.